Hello everybody and welcome. Thank you so much for joining me as I try to show off the best of modern retro gaming. Today we are coming back with Cathedral, a fun little Metroidvania style game that we've played for a while and have had a little bit of a difficulty. Behind in this door is like the main final maybe boss that we have to fight called Nidlong in the last episode and in some other previous episodes we've been having some difficulty fighting him i looked up on a video and on like how to defeat him and i gotta say it he, the person that i watched defeated him rather easy which was a little disconcerting in my opinion um the issue is trying to get him to follow you because he will follow you for a little bit and then run away so if you can keep him following you for a little bit of time and then kind of go do your thing um it's a little bit easier to do what you need to do um but we will see if we can get up here. If we can get him stunned with this thing twice, that makes a uh, pretty much all that we need to do is we stun him twice, I think, and we will be able to, def you know, defeat him in the way we need to do. And hopefully we can do that here today and i do not know if i'll be able to do it the guy that i saw play it was able to get him rather easily with very very little ah shoot um effort on his effort on his part oh man we already starting off bad yeah he had like half the life that i did and four health potions and was able to put him pretty much directly in his place but that looks like basically what we have to do there was no secret tips or um items that i may be missing or anything like that it was straight up maneuver out maneuvering him and then being able to um fire to break his mask so basically we got to stun him to break his mask and then we got to um once his mask is off it's all uh easy from there it's about trying ah, shoot i was trying to wait on him so that we could run ah see i'm already not doing good here and there we go we oh no i missed it oh wait no ah Okay, there we go. Ah, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him, shoot him. Okay, so if we do that twice, pretty much, and we have got him. And if I could just stay on there. Yeah, the guy that was able to get him did a whole lot better than what I'm doing in being able to defeat him. Um, definitely was much better on staying on these stupid platforms and i'm trying really hard to get up here so that i can was uh, i thought he was gonna move or like go away i thought it was in a position at which he would just stay and then move away once he was done but it's basically just trying to avoid him and that kind of frustrating because i there's no trick it's I just got to get good unfortunately and that is the crux of the difficulty here is that I have to hopefully get good enough so that we can be able to defeat him and if I could just get up there going up is the hard thing and if we could just avoid him long enough ah, shoot so that we can light these two things twice. I can't seem to avoid him at all. And I don't know what is up with that. I'm just not sure that I have the movement down of him enough that I can 
avoid him. There we go. But the problem is I need to be in the middle because he's going to come right down on top of me. Yep. Again, there we go. Got him there. Ah, shoot. He didn't hit it. No, no. So yeah, we at least lost three health potions there, which is not good, really. Can we get that done? Yeah, this is not going well already. And the guy, again, the guy that I watched do this did it so easily, so quickly. I'm almost like mesmerized at how well he did this because it was nothing short of like really amazing work on his part. Um, I get over here. I need, I'm just not going to get it here. And I don't think I have enough of anything to be able to be able to defeat him. This is like where I need to be. I don't know how he did this. I really don't. He like seemingly just so easily was able to avoid him. And I'm having such a hard time avoiding him. Um, he was able to zip and, z you know, move and avoid, evade. And he like had, I know he had less than four hearts than I did. Or yeah, four less hearts than I did. And only three health potions. And somehow I'm just not able to do it, which is a little frustrating. All I have to do is do this twice to be able to get his um, mask off. If I can get his mask off, that's the that's the thing there. If you can get his mask off, then what you do is you can just hit him normally. Ah, shoot. See, he'll come and hit you or he will either hit you or, um, ah, shoot. Come on, where are you? There we go. Ah, shoot, if I can make that jump first, that would be very helpful. Come on, light, light. Thank you. There we go. Okay, there's one. But again, we are, ah, shoot, gosh. If I wouldn't like get hit four times right there, that would make a huge difference, I'm sure. Uh, there we go. Okay, we got our weapons again, which means that's good. Okay, let's see if we can get him. Ah, frig. Already. Okay, let's see if we can get him to come down. I'm trying to make it so that I have a long run here so that I can do that. Oh, I didn't think I already had that. Sweet. Okay, I need the gun. This should be the, ah, the hit I need on him. And then basically, I think if I break the mask off, it's basically, yep, I could just hit him now. Oh yeah, okay, okay, now where are you, punk? Come on, die, 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 die. Yes, I think I got him. Yeah, Woo. that worked out rather well and a little bit easier. Ooh, he was hard. He was definitely the hardest guy that I had to defeat so far. We got the orb of Nidlong, a blue orb cold as the walls of Ice Peak Castle. Well, sweet. Uh, that was like um, new quest. Let's see what that new quest is then. Because I am curious where one of these is a quest. Return to the cathedral and enter the mystical door. Some of this we haven't done yet. And I wonder if it matters. Um, I cannot easily, I don't think, get back up there. Let's, I don't think that was a pretty high fall there. I am, yeah. So we're gonna have to take the long way around, it looks like. The good thing is that most of the 
basic enemies in this game were actually fairly easy. And that's the fun and interesting thing about this game is that it is a mostly a a game of you try to think where the, the, the levels are the difficult thing the some of the bosses were kind of difficult and um some yeah they're most of the normal enemies were fairly easy so yeah you just have to watch out for the bosses and the levels uh were ba pretty much your main difficulty in this game as they are rather i don't know if i'd go that like there are some like the um well that was a harpy they're annoying but m like i said most of the areas uh are like full of uh artificial difficulty in a lot of aspects and that is a little bit frustrating um but for the you know it's a lot of like this little bit of weird levels and spikes and for a while i really did you know for a little bit i didn't like it but then it kind of grew on me as i realized the basic enemies were not a difficult thing the difficult thing was just making it through all the levels and that's kind of where the difficulty comes from and that change I have no idea where I'm trying to go if I went all the way that way and I don't know if I can go down but let's see um yeah let's see if I can go oh that one's new didn't even see that guy forgot shield did not shield in time this way should take me back to a uh, waypoint one of the things again that they did really well in this game is make it so that you can get around and through and that sort of thing uh, very easily from area to area and that is one of the key aspects in my opinion of a metroidvania is that you have to make sure that you can not sure if you can get there from here and yeah yeah there we go um yeah one of the key aspects in in any metrovania is to be able to get through the um ouch i just ran into those spikes is once you clear an area you want to be able to get back to the main area and be able to go back and forth through all the different areas and they've done really well with these little portals that allow you to do that as such so all i have to do now is go down and avoid these harpies the harpies is probably one of the most difficult enemies that have been in the game um do i need to go yeah down i want that hot Uh, they have made it pretty nice where another aspect of a lot of Metrovania is is that as you level as you get new items it unlocks new areas and that has been done rather well as uh, also and a lot of the upgrades also uh, allow you to make cut cut sh shortcuts back through the world so where do I want to go um I want to go to the cathedral, but let's go to Ivy Stone Ridge really quickly because I know that there's a health place there that I can deal with. Um, I don't know off the top of my head where the health locations, which are each city has like this little health bank, but scattered throughout the other areas are uh, just random statues that will heal you so I'm kind of jumping back here real quick to get healed up and to get all my health potions back and then we can go on to cathedral on to the cathedral which is where um, basically where the whole game started you woke up not knowing where you were in front of this door and yeah it wasn't it was been a uphill battle since then this door right here that we are going to head to right now so i do not know if this is going to be the end or if this is just going to open a new area or something 
different or what. So I'm really interested in what this is going to um, have for me. Let's see, I need to go down into the, there we go. And then off here, and this is the door where we started at. And our little, you yeah, haven't saved the little ghost friend. Our little ghost friend there has been uh, helping us a little bit along the way. I wonder if some of these, like most Metrovanias, is that you could have done certain parts or you could skip them. This may be the end. I don't know. Let's go in and find out. We might have just escaped the whole world. Okay, quest completed. But now I have a new quest. So, Inner Sanctum. You have reached the Inner Sanctum. This place needs to be abandoned. Oh, seems to have been abandoned for a long Explore the Inner Sanctum and see where it leads. Well, let's just explore the Inner Sanctum then. Um, ouch. I was going to say, I know those little droplets are going to hurt me. There was an area in which I could not hurt any of the creature well not any of the creature but the main big creature there's this blood stage or blood area and i was unable to um effectively hurt the heart there um and um let me see if i can get my little things back up here um so i don't know if that's an area in which I have to complete. Okay, this is gonna be interesting. <laughs> there we go. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do with this, but we have a block now. Um oh, maybe I was supposed to. Okay, let's reset it. I think what I was supposed to do is leave it up there so that I can just pull it out a little bit and then we switch to your bone and nope, nope, that way. And that might, get, here we go, get us up and over. Oh, ah, I'm not sure this is the right way, but we are trying. I'm hoping, this is kind of interesting. I'm very intrigued at which, oh, this is out though, okay. That didn't go well for me at all. I was so not expecting it to just, okay, so we need our gun. Oh, okay, so. Oh, shoot. Oh, that doesn't look like fun. Um. So, what are we gonna do now? Can I bunch? Huh, how am I going to, I don't think. I will be able to do this from here. Nope. Um, can I get in those? No. Is this just a, now you're SOL and you've got to just die? That's not cool. Not cool at all, Mr. Man. Okay, I guess that's what we're gonna have to do. This, I, I that's so funny that I was able to get through it the first time without any trouble and now I'm having trouble getting through this little area there we go okay we've got to be ready with a gun boom okay uh run 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 oh shoot nope okay wow okay so we've got to be like right on our mark for this and it looks like it's going to be a thing in which we're going to have to um, be ready for each thing. So, why here? Oh no! I've oh shoot! I've already destroyed that, so I didn't need to do it again. No! I hope if I hit that button again, it'll be um, or hit that button, it will stay hit. Uh, we will have to. Here we go. Okay, so we need to come down. Ah oh, shit! Wow. I thought that Nidlong was going to be the thing that gave us all the trouble in this episode, and it does not appear that's going to be the case. And unfortunately, I feel it's weird that there's this spot here because I don't think I can get into that 
or any other spot. So I find that really odd that that's there. Um, but I don't know. Okay, so let's try and see if we can stay here, there. That's not too hard. You have to be careful though. Um, I need the magnet. Um, okay. Oh, no. Ah, shoot. I don't know what that was supposed to do. Oh, gosh. This is going to be, like I said, the levels have always been the real underlining difficulty here in this game. And that is very, very true here. This is seeming to be a very tricky level. Ah, I shouldn't have jumped there. A uh, level issue that we're going to have to get through and um be able to beat and that's kind of the crux of the game here i really don't like that the ugh. oh i should have you're gonna have to like uh zip or what the, the little speed boost all the way through this i really hope that this is going to go well oh gosh um okay so actually if i make that jump that's going to help me oh i'm gonna have to get a because yep so we're gonna have to turn around and get one of those to come back through it's gonna be a lot of just trying and seeing what we need to do in each section and it looks like we're gonna need a lot of ah shoot got killed again <laughs> there has to be some way to get back through there without dying that seems to be a very like uh i don't know what the word is uh very um Ah, shoot! A very, I don't know, unfortunate or um, not a very well, not a design. That's not the right word, I guess. And I can't get through any of those, I don't think. Or get high enough to get through any of those. Ah, Stay in there. Oh, come on! I guess I just hit my, I don't know what else to do other than just die right there because I do not know of a way to get through. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, I'm wondering if I can, I, I cannot get high enough on either one of these things. I'm close, but not, not quite enough. i to be able to stay in that area. Okay, I need the... Okay, okay. Okay, we got this. Uh. No, 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 come on. This is going to be incredibly difficult to get through. I have a feeling. Especially this entryway where I'm just trying to get into here. And I really have enjoyed this game, but it has notched up the difficulty a lot in this inter inner sanctum, in my opinion. Not that that's necessarily a bad thing, but it has definitely notched up the difficulty here in trying to be able to get through this uh, little area here. And you've got to do this zip light constantly. And hopefully you're, you're, you're able to get what you need and you just cannot get through it fast enough. Uh, 
I wish there was like a save spot on the other side over there. That would be really nice, but that doesn't seem to be a case here. Um, it really doesn't also seem that I have much um, uh, recourse about getting hit by these things. It just seems like, ah, crap, okay, okay. I can't, with being, like forcing to be able to pull those over and getting that right is just, it's not like hitting you, it's those one shot kills that is the difficult thing. If they just did damage to you and you were able to avoid whatever, you know, um, avoid them for a little bit or get hit and reheal or something like that. But, uh, okay. You know, ugh, no, no, go, 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 go. No, oh, so close. So, so close. Okay, we're going to give it a couple more tries in this episode and see. Oh, shh. Uh, 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 run into the wall. Okay. We'll give it a couple more tries and we will see if we can make it through. Oh! Okay. Ah, shh. That doesn't count. That one doesn't count. I totally messed that one up on. Wonder if, is there something, oh no, okay. I was wondering if there was something like above them that made it, like I can get up to, uh, uh, shh. oh no, come on. Like do something to get above them and it would be easier to get through there, but it doesn't. It did not seem like an easy thing to do. So might as well just be going through them. It's a good thing that I don't have much money. I have bought just about, I have bought just about everything there is to buy. I don't know unless there is some kind of other city or something that I have missed. Probably like, I bet you I've missed maybe a secret or two just going off of the, um, the map shows a um, an area of what you uh, each uh, the percentage complete of each area is what it shows and that is um, ah, shoot I didn't make it in time I thought I would get that through but I didn't man okay one more time we'll see this is one of these things that you're like you're constantly like okay I could do it let's try it one more time and you stuck here for like three more hours trying to do that one more time. It's what it feels like that kind of a game right now. Um, hey, got that. Come on, come on. You definitely have to be right on your mark on every little jump. And that is kind of the way this game goes so far. It seems like you have to be ready at each spot to grab that, um, land at the right spot and be able to pull this, you know, when you need it. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, we're faster, we're faster, let's go. Oh, what do I need to do? Duh, ah, ah. Okay, break, no. Oh, sheesh, I was so worried there. Woo, so, so worried. What do we got here? Piece of a map, unlocks the map in the current region. Okay, well, I didn't expect to have a map. Okay, so we got a little bit more of the inner sanctum to do. And I am worried like crazy that we are not going to make it and we're going to have to do that all over again. Okay, let's see what we got here. Um, let's get that guy out first. What does that do? Huh. Okay. Not sure what that did, but we will find out. That opened that, but oh, okay. I see it. I see it. You gotta get. Can I not? 
And I do... There we go. Okay. So that's what we need to do. Oh my God. I got this. We can do this. We can get up and we can... Ah, come on. Okay, let's go. Let's go. We just need to make it past everything in the whole wide world. Oh, can I... I don't think I can get on. Oh, I can. Okay, good. I was worried there for a second that I wouldn't be able to get on that. I don't know what is involved ahead, and I am a little worried that we're going to have another major boss battle for the end. Let's see. Let's see if we can get out. That looks like the exit. Okay. Well, this does not bode well. If you get a, in any game, you get an ammo restore, a save spot, and a health restore, you're in trouble. <laughs> there is something that is very bad that's about to happen. And it looks like I go into the funny little portal. Oh, no, I activated, tried to activate the portal, and it looks like something is, go. I can't move. The conduit, huh, interesting. Oh gosh, I don't know what this is. Ah! Oh gosh. Wow. That is insane. We're going to check that out one last time. And then we're going to see probably wait into the next episode to see what we could do about that. Because that is... I have no idea how that's going to work. Um, because there is... Wow, that just takes all my health away. Okay, well, we got that out. If we can keep it above us or below us in a good way, but how am I, like, supposed to fight something like this? I'm not sure. Oh, I bet you I'm going to have to hit those things on the end somehow with... Uh, let's try one more quick time. I bet you I know what I need to do. We'll probably have to go over and shoot. Those go away. Yeah, what we're going to have to do is... Gosh. Okay. We can do this. Let's try it again. See, what it says uh, again, one more time. I know we're running long. Let's just try one more time. Okay, we need the bone wand so that we can use our little platform. And then we need to switch to the gun. And let's see if we can get it to go over here first. Oh, that still hit us. Aha! There we go. Oh, I got a hit there. Ah! Okay, we need this. And then we need the gun. Okay, but I'm not sure how we're going to get those up there. To be honest with you. Ugh. Ah, shoot. Okay, that's fine. Okay. No! Okay. Ah. Okay. Well, we are going to end the episode there. We got one little last thing to do, it looks like. Thank you guys so much for watching, and hopefully... We can finish this game in the next episode. Thank you guys, and bye, everybody.